everyone. Hope you had a good Easter. Um, so I'm walking out right now. We're gonna go shoot uh, the 6.8 out at 6.50 again. Uh, in my last video I did, I uh, kind of showed you guys the different powder I used and with the 162 Hammer Hunters. So if you haven't seen what I've got going on, check out that last video so you kind of understand what I'm, what I'm shooting today. So 650 yards, uh, nice beautiful day, probably about 50 degrees, uh, crosswinds 10 to 15 mile an hour, maybe gusting to 20. So we'll go see what we can do and see what groups we can get. All right, so it's 650 at my elevation temp and barometric pressure, we're going 12 MOA up. And we got our crosswind from left, right to left. So we're gonna go right. 4.5 is what it calls for. Perfect. All right. Lock that in. All right, on my simulated elk target, uh, I got two down here, and I got one up here, so that's probably uh, a foot. So um, let's go redo another group, and I'll bring up my elevation a little bit. And the wind's not blowing as bad. The wind's not blowing as bad up here, so we'll uh, adjust the windage and see if we can't get a center hit. All right, so we made our corrections, and um, we'll shoot another group and uh, see how she does. And the last five, this one, this one, this one, this one. Um, I'll measure those out later and see what we got. Uh, all right, so my last three shots here, here, and there, uh, they measure five and a half inches at 650, which is about 0.82 minutes of angle per ballistic X. Um, not bad. Uh, you do have about a seven to 10 mile an hour crosswind. Uh, that's variable, so that might play a little bit with uh, the groups here uh, to where they could be a little tighter. But the wind is the biggest variable, and it's tough shooting in the wind, but uh, five and a half inch group at 650, um, I'll keep it for now. Uh, not bad. It's a dead elk. It's a dead deer. Could it be better? Sure. I'd like to come out when it's not so windy and uh, give it another shot. But, you know, I also want to add to, um, I'm, I'm shooting in the way that I would be shooting in the field if I'm hunting. So off of a bipod, um, I, I was using a rear bag as a rest. Um, I was also trying my jacket as a rest. So, and the wind blowing me around a little bit when I'm sitting prone. So, ah, you know, for field conditions and less than ideal conditions, um, I'm gonna say it's pretty good. So I try to practice how I'm gonna be hunting and I'd say, uh, you know, it's not terrible. So thanks for watching.